morning, everybody. Um, my name is Randy. Um, today, we are back for another session of Strength and Resistance. Okay, today we're going to be using a broomstick as well as a, a water bottle filled with water. Okay, so in this sequence, you know, we're going to start off just by getting our nervous system prepped up. So what we're going to be doing is, okay, we're just going to be marching in place. Okay, so just get those knees up, move those hands, just prepping that nervous system, okay, for our exercises ahead, okay? So we're gonna do this for about 30 seconds, okay? We're just marching in place, getting your knees up, okay, getting that heart rate up, prepping that nervous system, okay? You got 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, now we're gonna take some deep breaths. Breathe that breath in, let it out. In, let it out. In, let it out. Okay, now we're gonna march in place again for another set of 30 seconds. Okay, just prepping that nervous system. Just getting those Nervous system, fired up. Getting those muscles ready to work. Okay, so we're here. About 10 seconds left. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, okay? So now what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna get some stretches in. Okay, so with this one, you're gonna be taking our broomstick. Okay, we're gonna get some stretches in our shoulder. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be holding the stick like this. So tell you're gonna take your hand, put it at the top, okay? And we're just going up, just like this. Just getting some stretches, just feeling that stretch in your shoulder, just a little active stretch. Get that shoulder loosened up. Okay, so we're gonna do this for a count of 10. Okay, 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Okay, now we switch to the other side. So we put our hands to the top of our broomstick. We grab the bottom of the broomstick and we're just going up, just getting that shoulder, you know, just loosening up that shoulder, that shoulder capsule, that shoulder joint, just getting it loose. Okay, we're gonna do this for about 10 seconds. Here you go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good job. Now we're going to switch to the other side. We're going to do it at a different angle. Okay, now we're going to take it this way. And we're going to just open up this way. Okay, for another 10 seconds. 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Now we're going to switch to the other side. Okay, we're going to do another 10 seconds. So we're ready. Let's go. 10 seconds. Let's go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two and one good job now we're going to what we're going to be doing now we're going to get a little stretch in our pec muscles which is our chest muscles okay so now we're going to do this, the same thing so this time we're going to change the angle so this time we're going to go behind us a little bit just like this we're going to hold this one okay we're going to hold this for about 10 seconds 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 Three, two, and one. Now we relax, okay? Now we're gonna do the same thing again. Hold it for about 10 seconds. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Now we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna switch sides, okay? So we're gonna hold the stick. Once again, we put our hands to the top of the stick. And we're just pushing back behind us. 
okay? You're just getting that little stretch, that feeling that stretch right at the front of our, in our pecs, okay? Right in our chest muscle. So we're just gonna hold it for 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, now we're gonna do it again, okay? So we're just pushing it back, slightly push your stick back. You should feel that stretch right in your left pec muscle, okay? Right in your left chest muscle. Just hold it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. So, okay, so now we're gonna put the stick down. And what this time, what we're gonna be doing is, okay, we're gonna just take our hands and put it behind us. Try to get some a nice stretch, you know, in both pec muscles this time. Okay, now this time we can lean our head to the left. Get a nice stretch. You no know, neck muscles, we hold this for about 10 seconds. There you go, come back neutral and lean to the right. There you go, four, three, two, one. Good job, okay? Now we're just gonna march in place again. Couple seconds, okay? Trying to get that, get that little sweat going, okay? Prep ourselves for a workout, okay? Now with this, with this one, what we're gonna be doing is, okay, we're gonna basically be getting some, some movement in our, in our spine, okay, in our thoracic spine, which is our upper back, okay? So this one we can sit down, okay? So we can sit at the front of our chair. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna hold a stick, just like this, okay? Take a couple deep breaths. There you go, good job, okay? So now with this one, we're gonna take a deep breath in and let it out. Once we let it out, take the stick and we go over our head, just like this. Good job. And we come down, good job. And we take another deep breath in and we let it out. Once we let it out, then we go over our heads again, just like this, good job, okay? Now we bring it back down and we take a deep breath again. Good job. And we go again over our heads. Okay? That's three. We're going to do about five. Okay? Down. Take a deep breath in. We let it out. Up over our heads again. Good job. Now we go back down. One more. One more deep breath. Just let it out. And we go over our heads. Okay, good job. Now we're gonna put the stick over our shoulders. We're gonna hold the stick just like this. Okay, now we're gonna get some rotation. Okay, just get some rotation. Okay, just trying to loosen up that thoracic spine a little bit. Okay, so we're gonna do this for about, about 10 each side. Okay, that's one, two, good job, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, now with this one, we're going to do some side bending. Okay, so we start right here. This time we're going to do this this way. So we just side bend this way. Just trying to loosen up that spine, that upper spine, thoracic spine. Remember, you're only going to your range of motion, okay? Go to your range of motion. For a count of 10. That's four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, 
One more. And 10. Good job. Okay? So now we can put the stick down. Okay? Now what we're going to do. Okay? We're going to get some movement. So now we're going to warm up our hips. Okay? So with this one, we can start here. We can start about here. Okay? So now what we're doing is we just soft knees, just slight bend at our hips, and we just move in side to side, just like this, okay? So we can move for about six, two, so six small steps, five, six, good job. Now we're gonna do the same thing, going back, going back to the left. Four, five, six, good job. Now going back to the right. Four. Good job. Okay. Now, this one we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it uh, moving forward. Okay. So same thing. So slight bend in your knees. We drop our hips. We just we just stepping at an angle, just like this. There you go. Good job. Okay. Now we can turn around and do the same thing. Just getting some movement in our hips. Good job. We can do this for a count of six. Okay, six steps. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good job. Now we turn around. Last one. Three, four, five, six. Good job. Okay? Now, with this one, you're going to take the stick. Okay, so now we're just gonna get some movement, okay? In our hip, in our hip flexors, which are all the muscles in front of our hips, our psoas muscles, and all of the hip flexor muscles. So what we're gonna be doing, okay, for those of us who do a lot of walking, okay, these muscles are really what propels us into doing our walking and stuff, okay? So these muscles are, are what get us going, okay? So with this one, all we're gonna be doing is we're lifting our knees up. We, if, we, if we want to hold on to the chair, we can. Okay, we put our stick down. And we're just getting the, just driving that knee up. We're strengthening those hip flexor muscles. So we can do this for a count of 10. There's six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good job, now we switch side, same thing. We're just driving that knee up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, now we take a little break, get some water. Take a sip of water. We gotta stay hydrated. Remember, we gotta stay hydrated during our exercises. Okay? Good job. Now we take about a 10 second break. Remember, when we take our breaks, we gotta take deep breaths. Okay? Breathe in through your nose. Good job. Let it out through your mouth. In through your nose. Let it out through your mouth. Through your nose. Let it out through your mouth. Good job. Okay? Now we're gonna do another set of uh, strengthening those hip flexors. So we're just driving that knee up. Okay? You ready? So another ten, another count of ten. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Good job. Now we're going to do the same thing. We're going to switch side. So as we hold our broomstick, we can put our hands on our chair and we do the same thing. Just driving that knee up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. So for this exercise, we can put our stick down, okay? And this time we just, 
holding on to the back of our chair. Okay, so what we're gonna be doing is, hold the back of our chair. This time we're gonna get some, some extension, so we're extending our hips behind us, one at a time, okay? So to start, so what we're gonna be doing, so we just hold a whole chair, just like this, and we're just picking our foot up, just like this. Just extending our hip behind us. Start with the right one. Okay, so we do this for a count of 10. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good job, now we switch side. Now we do the left side, so we just hold in the, the back of our chair. Okay, and we're just extending our hip behind us, okay? What this does, okay, it strengthens our, all the, uh, the posterior muscles of our glutes, okay? We got our glute minimus, glute maximus, and glute medius muscles, okay? So we gotta get those muscles fired up and working. Five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. So now we take a deep breath again. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more time. Breathe out. Let it out. Okay. Now we go again. Okay. For another count of ten. So we go to the right. And just get it up there. Remember to only to your range of motion. Okay. We just. Extending that hip behind us. It's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Now we switch side. Do the same thing. Let's extend that leg behind us. Just working those those hip muscles. You know, you know glutes. That's five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job, okay? Now with this exercise, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be strengthening our adductor muscles, which is the outside of our hips, on these sides right here. So all these muscles right here, okay? You gotta strengthen those muscles. All right, those help us to move or, or move our, our legs and stuff, you know, to the front and behind us as well, okay? So, so inflection and extension, okay? So what we're gonna be doing is, okay, we can put our chair back. Now we're gonna be doing, okay, we just, just getting this, this pushing, that, pushing that leg out to the side. So we start with the left leg, we're gonna do this for a count of 10. It's two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, now we're going to switch side. Do the same thing. Just getting that leg up. Okay, just getting that leg out to the side. Strengthening those adductors. That's five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. So now we take a break, get a couple breaths, breaths in, breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. Again, let it out. Breathe in, let it out. Good job. Okay, now we're gonna do another set. Okay, so we have our hands on our chair and we just extending out to the side. Do this for a count of 10. It's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, now we switch, 
Now count of 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good job. Now we stop and take a break, get some water. Good job, everybody. Sip of water. Good job, we gotta stay hydrated. Good job, so now, as we put our water back, again, we take a couple, couple deep breaths. Let it out. Deep breath in. Let it out. Deep breath in, let it out. Deep breath in, let it out. Good job, okay? Now with this exercise, what we're gonna be doing is, okay, we're gonna be working our adductor muscles, okay, our groin muscles, which is the muscles between our legs. So with this one, we can, we can actually take our, take our broomstick, okay? Now what we're doing, we put our broomstick down, okay? So we just take our left leg, put it to the front, okay? Slightly, uh, slightly in front of our right leg. What we're doing is, you just try to touch this stick, okay? Just touching this stick with our left leg, okay? Good job, so we're gonna do this for a count of 10. That's one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Now we can switch sides. We do the same thing on this side with our right leg. Okay, so we put our broomstick down. We can have a, we can put our hand, you know, we can have our hand on our waist, or we can put it on the chair just to Give us more balance, okay? So what we're doing is, we're just slightly putting our, our, our right foot to the front of our, our left foot, okay? We're just touching it, just trying to touch the, just trying to touch the, uh, the broomstick, okay? So we're just working those adductor muscles. So this, again, we're gonna do this for a count of 10. That's two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Now we can switch side and do the same thing for another set of ten. Okay, so we just put our broomstick down. Okay, our left foot slightly in front of our right foot. And we're just trying to touch the stick. Okay, just trying to touch the stick with the inside of our feet. Strengthening those adductor muscles, which is the groin muscles. That's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Now we switch side. Do the same thing for one more set. Ready? Right foot slightly in front of the left foot. And we're just touching. Touching the broomstick, the inside of our foot. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay. Now we're gonna do another exercise. So we can this time we can. Put our, our stick down. Now this time we're gonna get some squats, okay? So what we're gonna do, okay, we're just gonna, you can have your hands out in front of you. If you, you can hold a chair if you want for more leverage, okay, or, or more balance and stuff. So what you're gonna do is you can hold a chair, okay? So if, you, if you're strong enough, you can put your hands behind your head or put your hands out in front of you, okay? With this one, I'm gonna put my hands behind my head, okay? So what we're gonna be doing is, we're just gonna be squatting down. 
So we're gonna get 10, 10 squats. That's two. That's partial squats. Three. Four. Keep our chest up. We're just squatting now. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Good job. We just strengthening those glute muscles. Okay, just got to keep those glute muscles strong. Okay. I'm going to do it again for not a count of ten. Okay. So we can have our hands behind our head. We can either hold a chair or we can hand, have our hands out in front of us. Whichever more, is more comfortable to you. Okay, you can do that. Okay. This one is really comfortable to me. Okay, so this is what I'm doing. So we're here and we're just squatting down, just partial squats. So kind of keep our chest up, okay, kind of keep our head up. And you're just squatting down. Count of ten. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay? So now we take a couple of deep breaths. Breathe in through our nose. Let it out. Breathe in. Let it out. Good job. Breathe in again. Let it out. Good job, everybody. Working hard. I see everybody out there working hard. Okay, now we can have a sip of water again. Got to stay hydrated. job. Once again, we're going to take a couple deep breaths for about 10 seconds. Let it out. 10 deep breaths. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, now with this exercise, now this time what we're going to be doing, okay, we're going to take our water bottle. This time we're going to take our broomstick and put it through our water bottle if you can. Okay, we're going to hold our water bottle just like this. So with this one, we're going to be doing is so just have it down like this, arms straight down. Okay, what we're going to be doing is we're going to do some deadlifts, just slight little deadlifts. So what we're going to be doing is hands down. First thing we're going to do is just drop our butt a little bit, just like this. Okay, and just come up. That's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. Six and seven. Try to keep the stick as close to your legs as possible. Okay? That's eight. That's nine. And that's ten. Good job. Now what this exercise does, okay, it works our whole posterior chain, chain muscle, which is our glutes, our hamstrings, which are behind us, behind our legs or back or lower back or upper back, all those muscles in our posterior chain, which is the muscles behind us, okay? So now we're gonna do that again for another count of 10. So we ready? So we're just going down, okay? Try to keep the, the stick as close to you as possible. And we're just slightly going down, so we're dropping our hips first, okay? So we're down, that's one, that's two, three, Four. Again, we're going to do this for a count of ten. That's five. That's six. That's seven. That's eight. Two more. That's nine. 
and 10. Good job. Okay, now we're going to say like this. So now this time, we did a lot of uh, exercises to strengthen our glutes, to strengthen our hamstrings. Okay, now we're going to do some exercises to strengthen our shoulders. Okay, so all the exercises we did before, those are to strengthen our hips, keep our hips strong. Okay, so now we, what we're going to be doing is, we're going to be strengthening our shoulders. Okay, and all the you know, the muscles that drive our shoulders up over our head, our lat muscles, okay, which is these muscles right here. All these muscles, we got to keep those muscles strong. Those muscles help to get our hands over our head like this, okay? So what we're going to be doing, we're going to take our water bottle, okay? So this time we're going to be, you know, we're going to slightly bend our, bend our hips the same way we just bent when we were doing our deadlifts, okay? It's the same way we're going to bend you know, to do our, our lat work. So what we're gonna be doing is, slight bending our knees, soft knees, okay? And we just, just bringing the, bringing the, the, the stick up and the water, with the water bottle, just bringing it to our stomach, just working those lat muscles behind us. Okay, so when we're coming up, we just squeeze. So we're gonna do this for a count of 10. That's two, three, four, Five, don't forget to breathe. We do these exercises, don't forget to breathe. Six, seven, eight, go nine, and 10. Good job, now we relax, and we're gonna go again for another set of 10. Okay, so every time we come up, okay, we go down and we come up, we gotta squeeze those scapulas together, which is those you know, those upper back muscles, okay? Just squeeze them together. Okay, now this time we're gonna do it again. Slight bending on knees, soft knees. Hold the stick just like this. And we just squeeze it, okay? Just try to bring the stick up with the bottle to us, to our belly button. And we squeeze. It's three, four, that's five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, so now we can put this down. Again, we can have another sip of water. Good job, everybody. Good job. We're working. We're working. Good job. Getting stronger. Staying mobile and getting stronger, okay? So now again, with this exercise, what we're gonna be doing is, okay? We can take, this time we can take, we can, you know, take the stick again, okay? We're gonna be working our, our tricep muscles, okay? So with this one, you can hold the stick, we're gonna be working these muscles right here at the front of our arms, okay? All these muscles here at the front of our arms as well as these muscles right here for our arms, okay? So now this time we're just bringing it up. Just bringing it up, try to slightly bring it up to our chest. Here you go, that's two, three, four, five. As we bring it up, we squeeze. That's six, seven, that's eight, at nine, one more, and 10. Good job, okay, now we're gonna do it again for another set. You gotta take a couple deep breaths before. Deep breath in, through your nose, let it out through your mouth. Deep breath in, let it out through your mouth. Okay, here we go again for a count of 10. Okay, now we're just bringing it up. Bring it up to our chest. That's one, so every time we bring it up, we squeeze. Okay, that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, and ten. Good job. Now we can. Put the stick down, okay? Now we can take the water bottle. Now this time, 
what we're going to be doing is, okay, we can hold the front of our chair just like this. We're going to take the water bottle, we hold it just like this. Now we're going to get some work in our triceps, okay? We just did some work for our biceps. Now we get some work in our triceps, okay? So what we're doing is split stance right here, okay? So left foot to the front, right foot behind you. You hold to the front of the chair, okay? Tuck your elbows, make sure you tuck your elbows into your side. And we're just extending our arm out behind us. Just working those, those tricep muscles. That's two, three. We can do this for a count of 10. That's four, five, six, seven. Every time you extend, you squeeze. That's eight. It's nine and ten. Good job. Now we're going to stay on this side. Okay, we're going to do another set on this side and we're going to switch sides. Okay, so again, we hold a chair, split stance. Okay, make sure to tuck your elbows into your side. Okay, and we just coming up and just squeezing those triceps. So when we extend our arm behind us, we're just squeezing for a count of ten. It's two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now we can switch sides and do the same thing. So this time our, our right foot at the front, left foot at the back. Okay, make sure we got good balance. We down. Okay, slide bend in our knee, our front knee. Okay, elbow tucked to the side. Elbow tucked to the side. Okay, we're doing the same thing, just extending our arms behind us. And we're just squeezing our tricep muscles. Okay? For a count of ten. It's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Take a couple deep breaths, and then we're going to go again for another set, okay? Deep breath in, let it out. Deep breath in, let it out. Good job, okay? Now we go again for the last set of, of, of the triceps. We just extend behind us, make sure we tuck our elbows, extend, and squeeze. That's one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, now we can sit in our chairs. Now with this exercise, what you're gonna be doing is, okay, we're just gonna get a, we're gonna hold a water bottle like this. We're gonna get the water bottle up over our heads. Okay. So this time we, again, we're gonna be working all these muscles at the front of our shoulders, okay? All these muscles at the front of our shoulders, we're gonna be working. So we can hold the bottle like this, okay? Or you can hold it like this, whichever one is more comfortable to you, okay? So we hold it like this, and we're just going over our head, just like this, for a count of 10. That's two, three, that's four, Remember, only go to your range of motion. It's five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Now we relax for about ten seconds. In, in, in that time, take a couple of deep breaths. Breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. Breathe in, out through your mouth. Breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. Good job. Good job, okay? So that's said it is. Now we're gonna hold a body like this, okay? You can hold it this way or this way, whichever is more comfortable to you, okay? So we can hold it this way and we're just going over our head. Just extending our arms over our head. 
We're count of 10. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good job, okay? Now, with this exercise right here, we can slightly come to the front of our chairs, okay? Have our feet, spread our feet out a little bit, okay? Whichever more makes you comfortable, to the front of your chair, you can stay behind, okay? But you can come to the front of the chair. This time we're gonna be working our pec muscles, okay? Which are chest muscles. So this time, we have our arms just like this, and we just come in and we just squeeze in, okay? Just opening and closing. We're just opening up and closing for a count of 10. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good job. Okay, now a couple deep breaths again. Good job. Good job, okay? Now we're gonna do it again for another set. Okay, so when we open it up, okay, make sure when we open it up, we're squeezing our scapulas behind us, okay? So when we open up, we're just squeezing our upper back muscles, okay? And then we're closing. Squeeze and close. Do this for a count of 10. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good job. So once again, we can get a, a sip of water. Good work, everybody. Good work. Great workout. Okay. Now we take a couple deep breaths. Relax for about 20 seconds. Catch our breath. Good job. Take a couple deep breaths. Got to get that oxygen to those muscles that's been working. Good job. Okay. Now, with this exercise, okay, once again, we can, we're going to be working on working a little bit of our, our core muscles, okay? So this time, you know, we could turn, our, turn to the front of our chairs, okay? We could have our arms down, just place them on the top of the chair, okay? And we can just open up just like this, okay? So what we're doing is we're gonna stack, we're gonna stack our shoulders, one line, our shoulders over our hands, okay? Make sure it's, your shoulders are stacked over your hands, okay? Make sure we're not, we're not dropping down like this, okay? We're not dropping down like this, okay? Try to have one straight line from your shoulder, okay? All the way down to our ankles, okay? So we open up just like this. When we do this, okay, we're gonna squeeze. Now we're gonna, we're gonna squeeze our, our glute muscles, okay? We try to engage through our abs, okay? So we, have our hands stacked over, over, have our shoulders stacked over our hands, and we're just gonna squeeze, okay? Nice and tall, okay? We just, right here, just like this. We squeeze our glutes. We're gonna hold this for about 15 seconds. Ten seconds. Five. Four, 
three, two, and one. Good job. Now we can come up, okay? Now, with this one, okay, there's different variations to this, this exercise, okay? It's a chair plank with different variations to, to this exercise, okay? So now we're going to add a, another variation to it, okay? So we're going to be doing two sets of each, okay? So we're going to do the same thing again. So shoulders stacked over our hands, grab our chairs, okay? And we just extend our, our legs behind us. Remember, we're just nice and tall. We're not down like this. We're not down like this. Okay, just nice and tall, straight legs, or uh, shoulders stacked over our hands. And this time, we're going to do some mountain climbers. Okay, so we're going to do this for 10 seconds. Well, 15 seconds, 10 to 15 seconds. Okay, you ready? And we, all we're doing is driving our knees up. Two, there you go. 15 seconds. Nice and tall. Shoulders stacked over our hands. And just driving that knee up. Five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Just working all our interior chain, all these ab muscles. Okay, these muscles help with, with our posture. We, Having a good posture, okay, we strengthen all these muscles, but not just these muscles we strengthen, we strengthen in our shoulders as well, okay, we got to keep in our shoulders strong, okay, by stabilizing our shoulders on the chair, okay, so now we're going to be back to the, to the regular planks again, okay, so we holding on to the chair, remember shoulders stacked over your hands, okay, and step back, we're just holding this for 15 seconds. Nice and tall, straight line from your head all the way down to your ankles. Okay? And we squeeze no butt. Okay? Squeeze no glutes, just like this. Okay? Nice and tall. Hold this for 15 seconds. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Now we come up. Okay, take a couple deep breaths. Good job. Good job, everybody. Okay, now we're gonna go again. Last set, okay? Some mountain climbers, okay? So remember, hands stacked over, shoulders stacked over your hands, okay? We just straight line, straight line from your ankles all the way up to your shoulders, okay? We're just holding this right here, just like this, and we just Driving that knee up for about 15 seconds. Just working that core. Our abs, those hip flexors. By driving the knee up, we're working the hip flexors and our abs. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Good job. Okay? So now shake it out. Loosen up our shoulders, get those shoulders loose from that workout, okay? And now, this time we're gonna, you're gonna end it off by doing some, some stretches, okay? It was a great workout. Now this time we gotta, okay? You gotta loosen up all those muscles that we worked, okay? So with this stretch to start, all we're gonna be doing is Okay, we're gonna hold our elbow. Okay, take our, take our, our left hand, grab our right elbow. We're just gonna hold this. Okay, this time we're gonna hold this stretch for about 30 seconds, okay? So we're just gonna hold it for about 30 seconds. Remember again, we gotta, we gotta breathe as we go. Allow oxygen to get to those muscles and relax it. So deep breaths in, breathe out. Deep breath in, breathe out. Stretching all these muscles right here, our lats, our triceps, okay, all those muscles. 
help to get our hand up over our heads. Okay, we gotta stretch those out. Good job. Now we shake it out. Now we switch side. So, right hand, okay, right elbow, left elbow in your right hand. Hold it, take it up over your head. So again, we breathe, we hold this for about 30 seconds. And again, we breathe. Take nice deep breaths. Good job. For more seconds. Good job. Now we shake it out. Good work. Now this time, we're going to stretch those, those chest muscles that we worked a little bit earlier. So this time we're going to take our hands. We're going to put it like this, but this time we're going to do it behind our back. Okay? So we're just going to hold this. At the same time, when we stretch these muscles, we can also stretch the muscles of our neck. Okay? So we just, as we go, we look up. And we look down. As we go, we breathe. Look up. Couple of deep breaths. And we look down. Cup again. We look down. We look up. We look down. Good job. Okay? Now with this stretch, what we're doing is, okay, we can hold it. Once again, you can hold this, hold this stretch by holding our, putting our hands on our waist. We open it up, maybe a little slider than, than shoulder width, okay? And we just lean into the side. So what we're doing this, we just lean into the side. If you have to hold your chair, you can do it. You can hold your chair just to have some balance, okay? So you can put your hand on your waist, or you can hold your chair, okay? We open it up slightly more than shoulder width, okay? Now all we're gonna do is lean to the right. Stretch those adductor muscles, okay? So the muscles of our hips, so we just hold this. For about 30 seconds. We breathe. Allow oxygen to get to those adductor muscles so they can relax. job. Now we switch, okay, come back neutral. Now this time we just drop to the left, okay. So now we're stretching the right addoc adductor muscles, okay, which is all gro those groin muscles. Got to keep those loose, okay. Get them strong, but also we got to keep them loose. Breathe in, okay, couple breaths. Breathe out. Allow oxygen to get to that muscle and just relax it. As oxygen gets to that muscle, we go deep, we can go deeper into the stretch. Okay. Good job. Okay. Now with this stretch, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna stretch our lower back as well as our or hamstring muscles, okay? Our lower back, hamstring muscles, as well as our calf muscles, okay? So with this one, we can have our hands down on our chair, just like this, and we're just bending over just like this. Try to keep your knees, try to keep your knees straight, okay? We just, just relax in here, okay? For about 30 seconds. Just holding this stretch. So let's feel a slight stretch in our hamstring muscles, our calf muscles, okay? All our glutes and our lower back. Just keep your hands, keep your shoulders stacked over your hands, okay? Good 
job, okay? Now we come up, now we come up, we can put our hands on our waist, okay, now we're going to stretch all the anterior chain, okay, which is our ab muscles, everything from our top of our shoulders all the way down, okay, so we can put our hands on our waist just like this, we just open up, just lengthen those, those muscles. So we can look up, now back down, look up, we back down, you look up again, all these muscles right here, our ab muscles, and all those muscles to the front, our anterior chain, stretch those out, good job, okay, now again, we're gonna go down again, stretch all these muscles at the back again, posterior chain, okay? So we put our hands down again, make sure we, you know, have a straight knees, and we just relax in here for about 30 seconds. So we breathe, and just relax. Take a couple of deep breaths in. Breathe out. Now oxygen to just relax those muscles that we worked. Okay? Good job. Okay? Now we back up. Okay, now we're going to stretch out that, stretch out that anterior chain again. So we're here, so we just push, push back, push our shoulders back. You're going to relax. We do it again. Relax. Good job. Now, last stretch for this one. Okay, we're going to do some side, side bending. Okay, so again, uh, our feet are slightly wider than shoulder width. Okay, we can have our hands on our waist, and this time we just lean into the left. Okay, just stretching this whole lateral line right here. Okay, just stretching our whole lateral line. So we just hold this for a couple seconds, about 20, 25 seconds. As we go, we breathe. A couple deep breaths. Come back up neutral. Good job. Now we switch side. Same thing. Stretching that whole lateral line on the right on the left side. Good job. Now last one. We're gonna do it again. To the left side. We lead to the left. This time we're going to take our hands over our head, okay? We're going to stretch off from, from all the way, you know, down, all the way up. So we're just taking that hand and just putting it up, okay? Stretching all our lats, right all the way down to the, the lateral side of our body. All that lateral line, just stretch it out. Feel that stretch all in through all, all that. Couple seconds. Make sure we breathe in as we go. Deep breath in. Allow oxygen to relax those muscles. Okay, now we switch. Last one. There you go. Good job. Once again, I thank you for being here with me. We got a good exercise in. We got some good stretching in. We got some good strength exercises in. We got to work, we worked our core a little bit. Got to keep those muscles strong, okay, as well as our hips and our shoulders. So once again, I'd like to thank you for joining in. My name is Randy once again, and I'll see you guys next week. Be safe.
Thank you.